Hello out there. This is DZ, your overlord, Deseran. And welcome back to Colot. <laughs> okay, so we're back in. I'm trying to find my way. So, I think we need to go this way. And then we want to go left. <gasps> Shit. Okay, we're not going left. Got it. Oh crap. We're going to die. see me. Don't see me. Crap. Crap. That's what, as long as I don't shine light on it, it can't see me? assume I'm going to continue from where the note was. <clears throat> yep. <sighs> okay. So. Oh! I get it. Okay, I get what I need to do. this guy is right now. I'm going to try and get out of here. Is that what I'm looking for? actually a survivor the sun is just starting to set I suffering for no reason myself, as if I'm standing there in the middle of the forest I'm not sure what is going on with reality. I'm writing with my own blood on a tree. 
My own name. Anton. No, not mine. His. The sun is just starting to set. Orange mist. Orange mist all around. I, I see their bodies coming out of the woods. I hear a scream. A horrific scream of terror. Is that my voice? I think it is. Where's Anton? Where did he come from? How did he get in? The sun is just starting to set. He's in me. He's in my head. He's coming in through my eyes. The eyes are windows to the soul. He has no soul. Where is Anton? I am dropping in a bottomless abyss, falling into the past. Dead and rotting hands are catching me on my way down. I can feel them whisper into my ear. Now you are ours. You will never leave us. I'm calling him. I'm calling Anton. Where is Anton? I don't know. I see nothing. My eyes are overflowing with blood. I have to escape. I have to run away. I have to start running. It's just starting to set. Oh boy. It seems bad. It seems really bad. This is a, uh, it's probably an important thing. Where am I? Okay, yeah, that's the thing. I found the thing. Okay. So there should be a way out to my left. If the map is to be believed. <gasps> there it is. <sighs> okay, I'm out. Outside. I am outside. Okay. Where the hell am I? Presumably here. Which means I want to go... Uh, left. Follow the path. Oh, God. Um, okay. Where is the next one? Holy jeez. Okay. There's 752, which is like... way back over here. I think I'll go for that last. Uh, 43 and 45. Okay, so 43, 95. Where is that? It's like around here. So if I follow this path to the left and go straight, that should take me there. If I've got this right. Okay, if I just stay on the path, let go. I think I hear a note. Oh, what? 29 North, 93 East? Oh god, is there a new one now? No?
Like, can I put it on my map or something? Where would that even be? 29... 29's here. Oh, that's... Is that where I am? Is that my location? If that's my current location, then that's really helpful. cave on the map? No. Oh boy. Okay, well. Guess we're going this way. Like that sound. Don't like that sound at all. Ooh. Definitely hear a page. we forgot to close the window vent. We ate breakfast, packed our things, and at 11 a.m. we were ready to go. We set off in the back of a truck, so it was a bit cold. During the ride, we talked about absolutely everything we could think of. On the spot, we spoke with some local workers. I remembered one in particular. He had a red beard. Friends called him Beardman. We cooked and ate dinner, and now we are resting. Hmm. Half of the group is looking at some maps. The rest are sleeping. I started handling the equipment and writing. It is still a bit too cold. My hands are shaking, but finally, my thoughts are much brighter than yesterday. No creepiness in them whatsoever. There's a long way ahead of us, but the only thing I can feel is excitement. It seems as if the forest is calling us. That beautiful, magical, dark forest. It magical. 7 a.m. We're finally here. We met... We slept in okay. The this should tell me where I am. Oh. Oh! It was telling me where a note was. Okay. So, okay, I'm facing south right now, which means I want to take... I want to go this way. Uh, mm, that's bad. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. I need to get back up there. There we go. Okay, okay. 
It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Back on the path. I will make sure to stay on the path. Okay, so according to the map, we should be turning here. Okay, so I'm going to want to watch for... So there's probably some notes in there, but I'm going to want to go straight down if I want to get the location. So I'm heading south, so then the turnoff should be on my right. So I just watch for... 3991 Okay, there's the way for the Aha, there we go. So that's right here. some twists and turns. Another turn off on my right. Definitely hear it. Sounds like the note is to my left. Aha! Found you. The weather is pretty good. We have the wind at our back. We arranged with the locals that they will give us a ride to the location of the second camp. We helped them unload the carts and waited for the horses. <clears throat> at approximately 4 p.m. we set off to continue our journey. We managed to replenish food supplies so we could eat something on our way there. The horses are moving slowly. It's making me sleepy. It's getting dark. The second camp was an abandoned village. We found a house to stay at overnight. In total darkness, we started setting up a fireplace. Everyone cut themselves on nails sticking out of the boards. Apart from that, everything was okay. Then, it all started. Mm-hmm. I bet it did. Okay. So I am... Wait, where are we? We just found that note. Right there. Okay. So wait, there should be another little kind of... Maybe not. Yeah, I 
think it's just this. I don't think there's anything here. Yeah. It's just that little bit. Okay, going back. Whoa, whoopsie. Okay, so we go back down. When we get down here, we take a right. I haven't found another camp or anything yet, though. Although, at least I know where I am. I wonder if there might be a camp over here, if I'm lucky enough for there to be one. Nope. Okay, backing out. We're going back this way, because I don't like the look of that. That should be here. Like, okay, never mind. Oh, whoops, no. Don't want to do that. Okay, so if I follow the path, what I'm looking for should be right here off the path. Due south. Is it this tree? Oh, wow. Okay, it's this tree. 3996. What the hell? I am an empty there is no hope. My body is a shell, and I am ready to absorb him. Um. Now I see the plan. I see the magnitude of devastation. The creator summons me, and I want to be his food. I am humming his tune. I am looking at the world through his eyes. I drink the blood of his enemies and taste the rotting bodies. I feel the sin sprouting under my skin. I hear screams in my head. I hear them calling me. I hear the calling of the ones that through him have already found their eternal shelter. Free them, my lord. Free them and take me instead. Fulfill your revenge at the hour of my death. Um. An army of angels comes out from the orange light. Their song is made of one powerful voice. I feel their presence, <coughs> their twisted faces, their black eyes drilling into my consciousness. They demand to finish the work. Oh, his presence is overcoming me. So poor and defenseless. What have they done to you? What harm? You were there, and so was I. A, a huge gate, and the Creator hidden behind it. Only those few who touched him could understand, but you could. You understood, and I understood through you. What the hell, man? Oh boy. Okay, 
Okay, backing away. Okay, so we were there. That means the last one is... Oh no, there's two. 4584. So, okay. So that's south. Okay, so I want to be going this way. Sort of. <gasps> Shit. Shit! <sighs> oh shit, oh shit. I can't move. Oh god, I'm in the I'm in the thing. I'm in the thing. Oh crap. 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 Oh, I think that's what I'm looking for. Saving. Camp. Oh my god. Okay, no, it's north of what I need. But it's saved. That's the important thing. It's saved. And I'm kind of safe. Sort of. Not really, but a little. So wait, where am I exactly by this camp? So that's 83. So I don't need to go far from the camp. Oh! Can you kill me here? I'm, I'm safe at the camp, right? You, you can't actually get me here, can you? This is like a safe zone. Okay, maybe not. Go away, please. I just saved you, asshole. Alright, well, I'm gonna call it here. Shit! So if you enjoyed this video, oh god, well, maybe if I run into the thing. Oh my god. Where is it? Oh! Oh! Shit! I'm stuck on a rock! My dear Vera. And there will be nothing. I'm spending my time... Shit! Nope! My dear Vera. There we go. I'm spending my time in the Institute on long walks in the park. Only here I can find solace. Only in the shadows of the trees. My thoughts are peaceful when I see how the sun brushes the green leaves and the wind covers my face in a gentle, warm blow. The doctors say the worst is behind me. The breakdown was temporary. It's difficult for me to say what triggered this state? 
I know you'll never forgive me for what I've done. The tragedy that I have contributed to shall never find any justification or explanation. I can only cover it up with madness. But I am aware that this is a pathetic excuse and I'm not able to hide behind it. I take full responsibility for what happened. And I am prepared to be punished. The doctors, however, say I will probably not leave the Institute. You must know I would rather rot in prison a hundred times for what I have done to you. I have to confess, I tricked you. I knew you would never, ever want to hear what I have to say to you. That is why I sent my friend with this letter to your sister. And after a lot of persuasion, she agreed to read it to you. To you. I thank her from the bottom of my heart for this. I'm ending this letter. I want to bore you no more. I love you and believe that someday, hopefully, I will be able to tell you all this in person. Luckily, my friend Anton is by my side at all times. He was the one that went to your sister. I hope this letter finds you both well and in good health. I wish you all the best. Forever yours, Vitali. Uh, uh, I'm somewhat confused. Okay. Okay. Going north. We're going to get back to that camp. And we're teleporting the hell out of here. Uh, camp? Camp. Where are you, camp? There you are. And boom. Go to here. Oh. Saving. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna call it here. Holy crap. Okay. So. Holy jeez. If you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and share it with anyone else you think might enjoy it. If you want to suggest a game, leave it in the comments below, and check out links in the description for Colot on Steam. Oh boy, okay. Um, also, uh, check out links in the description for uh, Chaos Child. Their can their channel, their channel, their channel is Chaos Plays. They're an amazing person, a great artist, um, a lover of horror, and uh, they are the ones that helped me decide to do Colot. So, please go check out her channel. You won't regret it. And in the next part, well. Guess we have a journey to make uh, to try and get up to here. I think that's the last one. Oh boy. Until then, though, this is DZ, your overlord, Desiran. You all have a great day. And I'll see ya. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha